What is going on, my reigning, defending WWE Supercard Champions of the World? We had a our first team event uh, going for the Royal Rumble card. And uh, I'm pleased to announce that we did go ahead and get that Royal Rumble card, which was Kane. And uh, we also got the Vanguard card, which was The Undertaker. It uh, skipped my mind for a hot second, but I remembered. And uh, here we go. We're going to go ahead and claim my first ever... Royal Rumble card! Kane, yo, welcome to the family! My Paisan, welcome. Uh, looks like, uh, King of the Rings finished, so let's just go ahead and only made it to the qualifiers, boo! We'll go ahead and claim that anyways, and just start up another one. Actually, I probably should've put Kane in there. What was I thinking? I wasn't. And Fusion Chamber, I have this to claim, which is just, uh... A green, a green ring, which is fine, because I'm just gonna throw this into the Royal Rumbler and activate that. Yeah, that's fine. Let me know if you guys have been doing, like, the rumbling or the Royal Rumbler, and if you've had any luck on it. Also got a cat card in there, and I'm just gonna work my way up to, uh, Vanguard. But yes, let's go ahead and go to the store real quick, pick up our freebie. Free packs are nice. Like getting the free packs. And get more clocks. No doubt, no doubt. Um, what else did I want to do? Wow, I have 348 cards out of uh, 350, so I'm definitely going to reach my card limit. But um, what did I want to do? Oh, I wanted to go to this. Because I saved my login bonuses for when I film, so I got some to claim. So let's go ahead and do it. 100 credits. Dolph Ziggler SummerSlam. 150 credits. Take that. And Billy K. Ooh, I think that might be a pro. I think that might be a pro. And then 200, and then this should be a primal card, right? Hey, primal Xavier Woods. Let me know. Is that, are those pros? I need to know. I feel like both of them could be a pro. No, none of them were. But how come it didn't come up like new card added? Like, that should be a new card for my catalog, then. Or did it come up and I just didn't see? <sighs> it's definitely a possibility. Alright, so I have so many picks. It's why I'm, like, leaving, like, 349 cards in my deck. Because when I play Team Battleground, when it goes to pick cards, this way I don't have to pick through all my cards. But let's go ahead and go to that. Uh, we have the best deck. So that means that we need to do all the attacking like not all the attacking but i need to attack the top three cards guys and i need to make my points count so hey babes i will text you back in a bit in a minute i can't even s speak um so yeah let me show you my team you can see i have plus 139 i have not done any of my attacks yet but i have the best deck out of air body but we out here and we're gonna get that work done so we're gonna go up against you eduardo with a plus 34, 134. So let's do it. Attack. All right. Let us talk about the Royal Rumble. Let's talk about it. Um, I thought it was awesome. Um, specifically, I, I really, really enjoyed the men's Royal Rumble. I don't know who didn't enjoy it. If you didn't, please let me know down in the comment section and why you didn't. Uh, um curious if we didn't but i i was so happy i popped when keith lee came out um that was fantastic to see him there he didn't need to win he didn't like he just needed to be in it um so definitely was excited about keith lee being in it um we had some surprises we didn't have john cena which um i predicted you know that john cena was gonna be there there was there was no john cena unfortunately um but we did get Edge, and uh, Edge's return was huge. You know, the guy retired, became a Hall of Famer, you know, had the, had the neck injury. Like, I didn't think I was ever gonna see the dude in the ring um, in that capacity. I didn't think he'd be back, and especially for Monday Night Raw um, with uh, Randy Orton, rated RKO. Like, I didn't think that was gonna happen, but I was shocked. But I was so happy, and I'm so happy for him. And that just shows you that, like, anything is possible. Like, 
I guess we should have seen it with Daniel Bryan, like, you know, his injury and, like, we didn't think Daniel Bryan was going to come come back. And, you know, he. I remember him giving his, you know, retirement speech out in Washington and, oh, man, and then he came back. And now Edge came back. So, huge. So huge. I'm so happy for him. I'm so happy for the WWE Universe. I'm so happy for, like, how everybody reacted for it as well. Um, I thought I thought that was great. It gave me goosebumps. I'm not going to lie. It gave me goosebumps. Um, but the winner, the winner of the Royal Rumble couldn't be happier. This guy, Drew McIntyre. Definitely deserving. I am a fan of Drew McIntyre. I think he's an incredible heel. Um, I liked I liked him back when he came out with like 3MB, you know, and I, I like him I like him even more now. <laughs> I liked him when he came out with Shane McMahon. By the way, what happened? Whatever happened to Shane McMahon? Um, I forgot like what happened with that storyline, but I haven't seen him in a minute. Um, but Drew McIntyre winning it all. Definitely deserving. Definitely that happy ending that I was hoping for. Uh, the Women's Royal Rumble? Ah, kinda wanted Sasha Banks in it. Kinda wanted Sasha Banks to win it. Um, I don't know. I feel like last year's Women's Royal Rumble was more memorable for me than this year's. Like, I don't know. It, it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't. Um, I guess I'm just salty that Sasha Banks wasn't in it. But, I mean, congratulations, Charlotte Flair. You, you got your ticket to WrestleMania. You're lucky. You're going. Uh, now we just got to see who she's going to uh, face at, at WrestleMania. Uh, she teased it on Monday, but she didn't really get into it. She didn't say who she wanted to go against. Um, typical Charlotte. <laughs> Whereas Drew McIntyre came out and he said, Yo, I'm, <laughs> I'm coming for you, Brock Lesnar. So, Brock Lesnar versus Drew McIntyre WrestleMania, I'm so looking forward to. Hell yeah. That's... Uh, um, it's gonna be unbelievable. And I really, really, really hope that Drew McIntyre gets that W and takes that title. It is... Ooh, it'll be a fairy tale. Fairy tale come true. Um, but what else? What else? What else? Bailey's match, I liked. A lot of y'all didn't even, weren't even room for Bailey. Well, during the live stream, we do the watch party and all that. But Bailey coming through... Uh, Becky Lynch coming through. It, it was a good. It was a good pay-per-view. I mean, I, I I really did enjoy it. So I'm happy about it. But now we got to see what's gonna happen for WrestleMania. Oh, by the way, there was no CM Punk. A lot of people were chanting for it. A lot of people thought it was gonna happen. But I mean, never say never. Just because it didn't happen. This Sunday, last Sunday at the Royal Rumble, doesn't mean that it will never happen. So, I believe it could. I believe we'll see CM Punk in a ring again. I believe we will see AJ Lee in a ring again. I hope we do, at least. I really do. I hope we do. Um, but yeah, no, it was good. It was definitely good. The build-up for WrestleMania, I can't wait for it. Um, I wonder if Brock Lesnar's gonna show up anymore, or like, okay, I did my Royal Rumble thing, and now I'm done. And I'll show up like a week or two before WrestleMania, and just bring the hype. But I hope he, he, he shows up. My cards. So yeah, as you guys can see, like, what I've been doing, just so like, um get back in so that I don't have to pick all those cards because I got a lot of cards stacked but I'm still earning my points from a team I'm still putting in that work because that's what you got it that's what you got to do if you want to be on forever smug you need to put in that work by the way I'm gonna go over back to ring domination I want to give forever smug huge shout out for getting both the Royal Rumble and the Vanguard card y'all rock so yeah there's that Johnny Gargano Man, I feel like we just doing epic. We doing epic, baby. Ooh, this is gonna be a tie. Are we the same person? No. I feel like I just threw the same card in. Oh, here we go. It all comes down to this card. Alright, so I got 1538 and 1486. 1530. My booty out of that one because I was about to lose and your girl ain't gonna lose. Now when um I gotta get my points for my team, I gotta put in that work. So talking about my team, let's go over to the team and do some shout outs. 
love my forever smugs as long as they put in that work if you guys don't put in that work there ain't gonna be a spot for you on the team just letting you know just letting you know we watching if you ain't getting enough shards if you ain't getting enough points like we watching so just saying tilted tyler what's up my general all the donuts are for you today only today only tilted tyler inside joke we like donuts who doesn't come on let's be honest we love donuts <laughs> ko mania wrestling guru john 17 just stone cold pcp boxy suri ace scotty tobias frankie static bobby vigetta joe supercard bruiser luigi coming in with them three shards the list of devin feelers Prim. thank y'all for being on the team so check out that card in my deck actually and like lock him in my first royal rebel card oh, i hate when that happens turn off my legacy rear teats boom wow first royal rumble card very cool from a team event shout out to the team getting the card shout out to you all let me know if you got the card or what tier you guys are and let me know the best card in your deck have an awesome rest of your tuesday i will see you champions in the next one take care bye bye don't forget to drop an elbow on that subscribe button and that like button for future videos and i'll see you all in the next one bye champs